Hopefully we can make some profit. We need to make more than $500 to be in profit. You know, I'm not the biggest fan of bonus buys, that's for sure. But maybe we can make some profit, so let's hop right into the first one, which is Tomb of Madness. I mean, just saying, we really have a bad setup here, and it just started before I hopped right into it. But, you know, can still be decent if we hit everything. It's a $1 stake on the majority of all games. Not on all of them, but on nearly all of them. So hopefully we can make some bank. Let's see. So finally the sound is here as well. I mean... I'm not the biggest fan of bonus buys, we just need to get that one on the top right corner, do we? I mean, we got five portal effects at least, overall, which isn't horrible, but, you know, I think that's the single one we're missing, isn't it? Okay, that's not a bad hit, I mean, we get some decent hits, but we just gotta get Caduceal for some profit. Otherwise, the 27x is not what you're looking for. I mean, come on, drop it in. Okay, I mean, we could hit it if we get lucky. Okay, that's not gonna be it, is it? It isn't, no. It's just a pink one left. And it's not gonna be Caduceal unless we hit it now, which is really damn unlikely. We didn't. Okay. $29 first bonus. If all of them are like that, we'll, we'll definitely end up losing a lot of money. But, you know, it's fine. So, as you can see, I got Sweet Bonanza as well. I think that's probably the po most popular slot on my channel. I like it the most, to be honest. So, I'm looking for a 200x here. If so... We'll be chilling if we don't. I mean, it's unfortunate. Okay, Malins are gonna connect. Give us a decent multi. I mean, a 6x. If we make over like $200 here, we might end up with profit overall. And if we don't, it's probably looking fairly bad. That's for sure. 12x multi. Okay. No connections though anymore. Which is bad. Personally speaking, I'm not the biggest fan of bonus buys as I mentioned. Not, not of bonus buys, of bonus hunts as I mentioned. Because they never seem to be uh, good for me. And... $23 on a $1.50, well, $1 stake, more or less. So far, two bonuses in, we got four more to go, and we got a tenth back, which is not good at all. <laughs> Book of that started again, I don't know why they did so, but we got tens, so the worst symbol you can get, more or less. And it's probably gonna be bad. Okay, a full board. Uh, don't quote me on that, that's not bad, it's a decent win. I think it's an 80x, isn't it? I hardly ever play Book of Dead, to be honest, because I'm not a huge fan, but at least it's something. Give, give, give that to me in every single spin, and I'm happy, that's for sure. Or a retrigger would be decent as well. A full line on the well on the top symbol would be decent, that's for sure. But it's not bad so far, by far the best one we've gotten. And I mean three aren't bad, could be better. But so far, not in profit overall, but at least a decent one. Four four is decent as well. I'll take five now and five again, and I'm happily leaving with roughly a 300 x here. So far 150x is not bad at all. I'll take that, puts us back to something at least. Okay, nice. At least something. I'll take it. Better than nothing. So next one's Legacy of Dead. We also got tens here, okay? Which is unfortunate. For a huge win, you need to get re-triggers here, that's for sure. So we need three books. Or at least full lines on tens. I'll take that as well. But the previous one was decent. Usually all the play and go bonuses are horrible for me. But you know, could all change in a single spin. If we get another 100x here, we're not looking horrible. So far, a 16x is not the best. And I think, to be honest, that one pays less because you have more symbols, but I might be wrong. So we just need a retrigger here, otherwise it's going to be doomed. Four is not bad, I'll take it. But so far, uh, we're not even anywhere close to profit. A 42x. And it's going to be free at least. I mean, I hope we. I wish we got a better symbol, I mean. But it's not horrible, it's just average, a 50x probably. Just below. I mean, I got Ri Rise of Merlin as well. And I got Merlin here, which is the top symbol. If we get a full screen... That's gonna be a good win, but honestly speaking, we need Ray Triggers here as well. It's more or less the same as Legacy of Dead. I mean, three can be decent as well. For profit, we need four, or three twice, or Ray Trigger. I mean, so far, all the bonuses have been fairly bad, to be honest. I mean, we got the top symbol, that's for sure, but... And... I mean, give us a Ray Trigger, it's just dead spins. I mean, you guys, a Ray Trigger now is needed. Not gonna be happening, unfortunately. Well, um, final spin. No Merlins to be seen. Uh, 31x, okay. Damn, that's horrible. I'm gonna gamble that, that's for sure. Won't take a 31x. I'll go for hearts. Okay, that one was a lucky call. I'll, I'll take 124. That's at least something. I mean, we got the Vinci's map left, so overall I think we're down money because I can get a 100x max there. But we, we'll see, I mean. Guys, I really tried my best to get uh, progressive here. I think I wasted like $300 in that slot. I didn't get it. I got the prize checker twice. And now I'm in here in the map bonus, which is probably the second best. 
It's not horrible, but not the best as well. We need to get to the castle, that's for sure. And we spin until it's game over. It's also a long bonus, so at least the video is going to be at least something. I mean, a 2 is not bad, and the further we get, the more we win, which is obvious. I think the max, as I said here, is 100x. I'll take that. Is it actually going to be a game over? <laughs> no, it isn't. Okay, great folly. It's going to be a 5, which is not bad, so hopefully we can get to the castle. We might be in profit then if we get there by like a dollar, but <laughs> if we do, it's better than if we don't. That's for sure. A 1 is not <laughs> the best number to roll here, that's for sure. I mean, at least we had some fun. It's always fun to do some bo bonus hunts. I like bonus buys more, pr personally speaking, as I mentioned. But, um, yeah. Come on, give us a 5 now. Hopefully not a game over. It's not gonna be a game over. It's gonna be a 4, which is not bad. So we'll get here. That's at least something already. It's not horrible. I thought I'm gonna go ahead and play some Monopoly, I believe. It's gonna be game over, is it? Yeah, unfortunately. $60 win here. So overall, we're gonna gamble that as well. On a 5x. Because I'm risky, I picked that chest twice before. It's been that one. I'll pick that one again. And... It's still not that one. Okay, it's unfortunate still. It wasn't a huge win, so I'm not complaining. I'm gonna play some crazy time now. Let's see if I can make some bank there. Hopefully, that's possible. Let's go. Okay, guys, so we just missed the crazy time. I got $380 left, so I'm basically down 120 from where I started at, which is unfortunate. But, you know, bonus hunts can go either way, just like bonus buys. That's for sure. We'll try to make some money here. I mean, crazy time, a fun game to play all the time. I'm gonna do some bets here. I mean, 40 is probably decent, and we'll do... We'll do some some of something here. I mean, like forty. So if we hit the two, it's decent. Especially if we have if we had a fifty x two. I mean, you can get a multiply at the top slot. That's for sure. I think everybody knows crazy time, and you can win huge here. A crazy time for three x. I'll take that any day. It's probably way too fast, isn't it? Oh, actually, we might have some potential on our hands there. Might be a crazy time. Is it? Boy, that's unfortunate. It would have been a thirty dollar bet, which is actually something. I mean. Unfortunate, damn, really damn unfortunate, you know. We're just gonna repeat our bet, more or less, and I'll put $10 on every single bonus, and I'll put like 50, 61 dollars and 80 pence here if I'm able to do so. So we're down to $200 if we lose that one, you know, I always do big bets in live games, I don't know why, it never seems to pay off for me, but give me a 10x2, and I'm happily leaving with some profit. 5 with no multi, I mean, cash hunt is decent, it's probably better if we hit a 2 and not a coin flip, so hopefully it just stops right before the coin flip, which is better because it's very damn unlikely that we're going to hit an 18x and a coin flip, that's for sure. I mean, at, at least a win, I'll take it. Some guy won two and a half grand. Doing some big bets, I'm not grateful, eh? Because, honestly speaking, I haven't had the best of, of sessions here in crazy time. I always seem to lose, and we'll let something here. I mean, a $115 bet. If we lose two of them, we're basically broke. Well, three, more or less, if we lose that one as well. But it's gonna be a 50x crazy time now anyways, and I'm gonna hit it. Crazy time, 3x, okay. That one's far too fast, though, that's for sure. One's far too fast. And um, we might be looking at a coin flip, are we? No. We're looking at a one, which is bad. Whatever, nothing I can do about it. I'm gonna dodge the two for now. I'm gonna do a $20 bet here, and I'm gonna do $30 on 10. I'm gonna dodge the... I just feel like it's gonna be a 10. I'm gonna dodge the two. I'm probably gonna regret it. It's gonna be a 50x2 now. If so, I'm gonna be really salty and probably... I'll probably never play, um, yeah. Crazy time ever again. But, you know, we'll see. Let it be a 10x10. Or, it's gonna be cash hunt with no multi. I won't say the cash hunt with a 10x and I still hit the lowest multi, so... I mean, it's not the best coin flip at least. No, okay. I mean, at least I, been, I didn't bet on two, it didn't hit anyways. So, I'll take it. But uh, not the best session. Lately, I've been losing quite a lot here. I've been winning a lot as well. But today hasn't been the best of all days. So, I mean, profit, hopefully. It's gonna be a pachinko. $20 in pachinko, a $100 bet. If we lose that one, we're basically down to $100. And I'm gonna do my own strategy then. I'm gonna bet all on two. In case I hit it, I'm gonna bet on two again. And in case I do, I'm gonna bet $900 on two yet again. So we'll see if that happens. A crazy time with a 3x multi. I mean, we're nowhere to be seen, that's for sure. Coin flip might be might be a 10 that time. Did we actually just miss a 10? Okay, no, we didn't. We missed a 1, which is not horrible. But I'm going to do my strategy now, which I do sometimes. I usually start off with bigger bets, bets than 100. But, you know, that's fine. Let's go with a $100 bet on 2. And 
in case it hits, I'm gonna do 300, and in case that one hits, I'm probably gonna do 900. Or I'm probably gonna cash, we'll see. I'll, I probably won't hit the first one anyway, so we'll see what happens. I mean, has been quite fun today. Um, yeah, not the best bonus hunt, honestly. I did one dollar spins. I actually didn't get lucky more or less at all, as you saw. But, could have been decent as well. You just gotta hit one good multi, and that's gonna be a coin flip, is it? Okay. No, it's gonna be a one. So, as I mentioned, we lost the first, but anyways... I mean, another zero dollars at the end of the video, which is unfortunate. I mean, lately my luck has been horrible, you saw it. But whatever. I'm not gonna deposit anything now. Thanks, Rubert, for hooking it up. I mean, I'm not getting lucky lately at all, but I guess it's how it is. I hope you enjoyed regardless. It was decent, not the best, but you know, cheers.